Can you really get a good designer crossbody for under $1,500 these days? Believe it or not, you can, and that's exactly what we're getting into in today's video. Handbag prices have literally gone insane, you guys. Like, I can't believe how much they've skyrocketed. Like, it literally feels like a runaway train where they're just going and going and going, and like, who knows when it's going to stop. But the good news is that if you're in the market for a very good designer crossbody bag, I have a big roundup here for you today, and they're all under $1,500. And no, they are not all micro bags either. Some of them are actually very good designer bags. If you are looking for a specific designer, I'm going to have it linked by chapters below. This roundup is going to include both designer premium and some entry level designers too. So anyways, let's get started. So all of today's handbags will be linked in the description box below, starting with the first, which is the Saint Laurent Lou camera bag. Now, if you're looking for a great everyday bag, I absolutely love this option. It is in the quilted leather. It has an adjustable leather strap and it comes in right under $1,500. I believe it's priced at $1,490 as of the time of this video. Again, if you might be watching this in the future, there are price increases that happen. So as of right now, it is priced at $14.90. This one does come in 10 colorways. It's a very roomy bag. If you're looking for like an everyday bag, I would definitely say that this is a great option. Another cute camera bag option is the Balmain B Army. Now, I think this is also like a pretty good everyday size and it comes in at $995. It's actually under $1,000 for being a designer designer bag. I will say one thing about this bag that you might want to be aware of is that it is linen. So I would be a little bit wary about color transfer with this one if you're going to plan on wearing it with dark denim. But otherwise, I think this is a really cute bag, especially for the spring and summer months. The next bag on the list is the Bottega Veneta Mini Loop. I think this one is so cute. It's definitely a little bit more different than the other crossbody bags on this list. So this one comes in at $12.50 and it has six colorways. It also has a leather strap so more of like a comfortable everyday bag if you're looking for something a little bit more understated and not like out there in your face logo heavy I think this is a great option to try the next designer crossbody on this list is a personal favorite of mine there's two that are personal favorites and that's the Gucci Soho disco bag this bag is literally a workhorse it is such a good bag I use it almost daily in the spring and summer months. I have it in the nude, but it also comes in black. And if you're looking for pre-loved, I believe it also comes in red as well. This is a soft structured bag. It has an adjustable leather strap. It's very comfortable and it's really roomy. Like you can fit so much more in there than you would think like I mean, this bag literally is a workhorse. I do have a review on this bag, so I'll link that video up here and down below in the description box. It also shows exactly what fits so you can get a better idea. And again, this is an excellent pick right under 1500. I know this is a roundup of designer crossbody bags, but I had to include a few entry level ones that caught my eye too. And one of them in particular is the Tory Burch Eleanor bag. I think this bag is really elegant. It's really very beautiful. It has big gold hardware, very on trend right now. And there are a couple different color options too to choose from. They have an option with the leather strap that's adjustable. Personally, I love the chain strap. I think that one looks really beautiful, really classy, and it kind of makes the bag look a little bit dressier. This one ranges in price from $5.98 to right under $900. Lots of pretty colors to choose from. I definitely would check this one out. Another great crossbody to try that comes in at $15.90, so just $90 over the maximum price point is the Saint Laurent Lulu. The toy version is so, so cute. I've had this on my wish list for a little while now. I'm looking for the black and black version, but this is another really elegant, great day to night bag. I own the Saint Laurent Lulu in medium. I do have a review of that if you're interested. The toy is obviously a lot more compact and small, but I think it's really cute for every day. This one comes in multiple colorways. There's also a denim version and suede as well. You're also gonna see your seasonal colors and in the interior, there's a zipper pocket and two compartments, which is nice. It kind of helps you keep your bag a little bit more organized. The next bag on my list, I'm going to include two size options for you. And that is the Gucci Marmot. I think this is another really cute, 
day to night bag. The mini one is $13.90, again, as of the time of this video, and the small one comes in at $15.50, so just a little hair over the $1,500 price point, but this one is a good day to night bag. It's very comfortable. I actually own this bag in the small size in black, and it has the adjustable strap. It has the gold GG logo. I mean, it's definitely more of a statement making bag. If you see it, you know it, but just a cute, everyday crossbody as well, right under 1500. Another really great bag to try is the Gucci 1955 horse bit. This one comes in at 1550. Yes, I went $50 over, but it is super cute. It is more of that camera bag style and it has the logo, the Gucci logo print in a canvas fabric. And then it has leather as well. And then leather straps. So this one is really cute for every day. I love the mix of the horse bit with the logo print on it. I think it's really unique and also comes in an all black leather version too. The next two bags on my list, it's two versions of the same bag, is the C by Chloe Mara bag. I think this bag is so adorable. There is a version with the big gold O on it. I love the hardware. It comes in several colorways and it's right under $500, so a really great price point. Then they have another version of the Mara bag and it doesn't have the gold O on it. Instead, it's a little bit Bit more understated if you're looking for something without the ring and that one comes in at $395 and three colorways again I think this is an excellent like everyday bag super affordable it's really cute I love the shape too so definitely check that one out if you're looking for something a little bit more distinctive speaking of distinctive I had to include another Gucci pick here and that is the round Ophidia I think that's how you say it bag I am a sucker for a round shoulder bag or crossbow bag. I just think they're really adorable. Probably not the most practical. I don't know. I don't have one yet, but it comes in at $14.90. This one has a really cute chain strap detail, the Gucci green and red stripe, and then comes in the print. This next bag has a couple of options for you to look at, and that's because there are a couple of really great contenders and I couldn't pick just one. And that is the Saint Laurent wallet on chain. Now, technically this is a crossbody, even though it's a little bit more of a hybrid clutch slash wallet, but I had to include on this list because First of all, it's beautiful. Second of all, it's under $1,500. And I feel like this is really versatile. Rather than just getting a clutch or getting an evening bag, this is a really good like day to night option. This one starts at $1,250 and it comes in a glossy leather. It comes in quilted leather and it also comes in the croc embossed leather, which I really have been liking myself. I think there are a lot of really cute options, whether you wanna go for black or more of a creamy nude. Like again, I think this is a really good versatile buy looking for more of an everyday crossbody, something that's kind of more of a workhorse, maybe more casual, maybe more for travel. I am really loving the Senrev Cadence crossbody. Like this bag has a beautiful shape. It's very classic, very timeless, good quality details. I love the gold hardware. Again, just a really good everyday bag. And it comes in at, let me see, right under $700. So really good price point on that one. This one comes in five colorways. It has an adjustable leather strap and it has a fairly roomy interior. Again, making it an excellent pick if you're looking for something that's great quality and that looks great timeless style, but under a thousand dollars. By the way, if you have any that I did not include on this list, make sure you leave me a comment below and let me know because I am always on the hunt for great crossbodies, especially if they're under $1,500. It's actually one of my most frequently asked questions, which is why I put together this video for you today. Another really affordable crossbody option is the Stella McCartney vegan leather camera bag. This has like a perforated detail. I love the strap too. So the strap actually says like Stella on it. It, and it's like very casual kind of how we were seeing these guitar straps with Dior and other high-end designers. This one comes in a couple colorways. I'm really liking like the cream and the white for summer, but there's some other options too, like black. And I saw a blue one, I think as well, which was very, very different. But again, if you are looking for something that's maybe vegan leather and a camera bag that's under a thousand dollars, this is definitely a good one to check out. The next bag on my list is the 3.1 Philip Lim Mini satchel. I have always loved this satchel. I've had a crush on it for many, many years. And this mini version is super cute and comes in under $700. And not to mention a ton of colors. I've seen it in black. I've seen it in blue. I've seen it in red, cream, hot, pink, like 
whatever color you like, you will probably see this bag in. I think this is a really cute option if you're looking for something crossbody that isn't necessarily a camera bag, but still has plenty of room to hold all of your items. Speaking of camera bags, I will see you over on the next video here on the Gucci Soho Disco Bag Review. It is an in-depth review of the bag and exactly what fits. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe if this is your first time here so you never miss a video. And let me know in the comments below which bag is your favorite or if I missed any that I should have included on this list. I will see you next time. Bye.